more than one hour guys i've been trying to do my intro and also i've been trying to like look for place where i can sit and, and balance up you know in order to do video for you guys you guys know the struggles here in dubai is too much seriously guys if somebody tells you that dubai is easy tell the person you're a liar dubai is not though you have to pay for bed space here in dubai we don't stay in fancy places like in africa yes we do not stay in fancy places like in africa and to have uh, all the fancy things that we do have in africa because it's expensive you came here to work and not to stay in fancy places and like i say i came to work in dubai oh, not to stay in fancy places so yes you guys you always see me do vid sit down videos outside and people always be passing yeah people are always passing behind me yeah that is how dubai is guys that is how dubai is because you're not you don't, you don't hi guys welcome back again to my youtube channel <laughs> It is your girl Kara Epitoe. I'm a Korean YouTuber based in Dubai. If it's your first time here, thank you so much for clicking in. I'm called Kara Epitoe and I do videos based on faith, relationship and lifestyles. And today I decided to come to the park to do videos here. Yeah? And because I I decided to come to the park. <laughs> So I decided to come to the park in order to do a video for you guys because you know I've not I've been sitting down on guys doing videos here and there and I felt like okay let me just change the place and so I decided to come today to the park in order to do a video. I don't know if you guys can see me clearly. Yeah, I think I don't know. If you guys can see me clearly, please just let me know. Yeah, like I said, I decided to come to the park today in order to do a video. Yeah and this video is a surprise guys it's a very big surprise <laughs> so guys today i am with this package mm -hmm. uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> so today i am with this package guys and i'm going to be talking to you guys about this package and guys look I'm not gonna say that I am perfect, but I, I am striving to perfection, okay? I always tell people that when you get, when you, when you want to do something in life, right? You make sure that whatever thing you do in life, do it perfectly well. Don't do it and then you expect something back in return, but just do it because you love what you're doing, right? <laughs> am I, am I, am I, am I saying something? Am I saying something? If I'm saying something, just just let me know. Yeah, I'm saying something. So guys, <laughs> don't mind me, Jerry. So guys, like I was saying, if you want to do something in Dubai, like if you want to do something in life, right? Do it. Do it with all your heart. Do not do half and then expect something in return. Just do it because you love what you're doing. Don't do it because you want to expect something. You expect something from people. No. If it's your job, if you find a good job, if you find a job, whatever job that you're doing, I'm not talking about scamming or prostitution. No. Yes. Let me let me let me sound that in you guys' ears. Let me sound it in your ears. I'm not talking about prostitution and scamming. I'm talking about good jobs. Good jobs good jobs jobs that will not put you into trouble you, you guys remember when you're doing a position when you're doing a position job you will know that at the end of the day you will have hiv aids gonorrhea syphilis all of those kind of sicknesses and maybe get pregnant got it and when you do that you're going to suffer in life because maybe that's even just the one baby or the five babies, the six baby that God was supposed to give to you. But you took you took it out. But when it's time for you to get married, you're gonna ask yourself, well, why? Why did I do this? You're gonna start regretting. So yeah, I'm not I'm not talking about that kind of a job, okay? I'm talking about a good job. If you find yourself doing anything in life, make sure you do it well and perfectly well. Don't do anything because you're expecting you're expecting something in return. That's not how it works. When you're doing something in life, make sure that you're doing something in order to because you love what you're doing, and also because you are the people that you're you're working for. 
okay as you guys know i'm a tutor here in dubai and i am i've been here for over for or almost getting to three years i think here so uh and i've been working you know it's not been easy as well i i, I got a waitress job i got sales job and none of those things suit me a lot of time like i will go to work and come back very late and it it, it was really it was, it was really mad on me like the first job i got in dubai i i worked for over 17 hours it was really it was terrible yeah it was because i asked myself why should i be working this much when i know that like at the age of 50 60 i will not be able to work again because I've, I've, I've used all my strength all my whatever in this job you know so i decided to look for another job so when i look for another job uh that was waitress i i worked there for like some time you know but it wasn't still going i had to quit and i started looking for another job again so guys i'm going to be talking to you a story of how i got my job in dubai okay yeah i, I i'm going to be talking to you guys on how i got this my teaching job in dubai the job i'm doing right now i'm gonna be talking to you guys in another video so make sure you watch that video so this video is gonna come up before that one so yeah or maybe the that one is gonna come up before this one i don't know yeah so today is the second of december 2021 and i came here because I, like i said if you want to do something in life if you want to do anything in life make sure you do it well even the bible says if you find yourself doing anything do it well do it hundred percent don't do it fifty percent don't do it eighty percent do it hundred percent guys like i said this god this job that i got sorry you know at times you do mix you, you make mistakes so this job that i got this job is actually very good because i have two days off per week I have to I have two days work per week at times I work just three hours a day at times I work five hours a day at times I work nine hours it depends how many how, how many hours I want to teach okay so it's my decision how many hours I want to teach so I'm a teacher here in Dubai you guys I think I'm gonna be giving you a clip of this. I'm, I'm actually a private teacher here in Dubai and I've been working for over I think almost a year now and um, I thank God for the job like I said I'm gonna be talking to you guys how I got the job here in Dubai okay and I want to be talking to you guys in details so yeah um, when I got this job guys I was just so happy about it because the timing were okay I go to work at 8 30 in the morning and I come back around 3 I come back around 5 so like it's it's just so beautiful to me you know it's difficult to see that kind of a job here in Dubai yeah it is difficult but be with God by your side that's why I always say that when you have God when you work with God, when you work with God in spirit and in truth, don't work with God in the side way. Don't work with God because you want God to bless you. Don't work with God because you want people to see that you're working with God. Don't work with God because you want you want you want attention from people. No, work with God because you love God. Work and working with God means all your sins, taking it off your body, and making sure that you serve God in spirit and in truth don't lie don't steal don't fornicate don't adopt like don't don't do something that you know that god does not like save god in spirit and in truth and he is going to reward you in a very beautiful way like just the way he re repay me so guys anyways let's go straight yeah to what we are here so i got up uh one morning and i went to work yes i think that was yesterday i went to work and my boss surprised me with a gift <laughs> i don't even know what is inside this gift but mm -hmm. i'm going to open up and you guys we are going to see it together i don't know what is inside this bag but yeah it's a gift my boss parents actually gave me this because they are like oh because you know these people they are polish people and they don't speak english so i teach them english math and at times i do social studies with the kids so yeah i have been doing my job well <laughs> 
I have been doing my job well guys I've been doing my job well and they decided to give me this gift as a gift for my Christmas and they taught me uh, like oh my god it's just that I didn't want to video like guys I tried to video it but because you know um, they are they are very shy when it comes to camera and I didn't want to like force them to do what they don't want yeah so I just had to allow it so they told me oh Carrie you've been doing great with my kids you know since we came here uh, they, 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 they didn't know anything about English but I've been getting how they speak you know because they, of course they're, they're, they're working and I've been like the way they speak English the way uh, uh, like when they go outside they speak with other kids in English because they could not do that before but when I came and start I started teaching them English they 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 um, they actually improve and they are doing great now and they are doing great and you know we just want to appreciate you with this gift and I was like oh guys know how things are like your job site and you know you just you just you just have this feeling oh oh like because I, I felt I felt so special that time guys I felt so special and so happy that I have been doing my job well yes guys so they gave me this I'm gonna be opening it for you guys for us to see what they gave us okay so this is what it is this is how it comes like this and Let's open it together and see what is inside. So, oh my God, guys, look at this. This is like a heart. Oh my God, guys, look at this. Look at this. This is a heart, like a carving something, like a heart. You guys know in Polish, they have, in Poland, sorry, they carve a lot of things like this. Yeah, they do a lot of things in Poland like this. I think you should read uh the the history of poland the history of polish people you can you can actually see that like uh if you go to google and you read the the history of polish people you will know that they they do a lot of carving things like like this yeah so they actually did this for me uh -huh. they gave me these guys <laughs> okay this is one and the second one they did was they gave me this so this is uh Christmas happy Christmas Eve. So this is in, actually in Polish. I don't know uh This is in Polish like this this writing is in Polish as you guys can see Yeah, okay, like I think it's like this. So this is actually like a Polish handwriting You guys can see that right? Yeah. <laughs> So this is what they gave me guys they gave me for christmas of course like they say happy christmas eve yeah and they gave me this this is actually very expensive in poland i know yeah so they gave me this <laughs> yes i'm so happy guys i am so happy tell me comment down below if they have actually given you a gift at your workplace to appreciate your work have they done this to you before at your work job at your job to appreciate your work and what you do comment down below and tell me about it and let's 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 interact together <laughs> i'm just so happy about it guys so this yeah. they, <laughs> so this is what they get me and there's another one guys there's another one so you guys can read that you can read that i don't know polish but if if i know a lot of you a lot of you guys are, are are watching me from poland so you can read this and tell me what the meaning is yeah so yeah then the next thing we got here is oh my god <laughs> they gave me these guys they gave me this it's like a um this is like a chain let me put it on so we can see it so this is how it is like and just you can wear it this way you can wear this with your traditional wear if you want you know if you want to wear it so this these people actually did this guys they did this and they gave to me this is so this is so beautiful ah! <laughs> this is beautiful guys so they gave me this and this and the love the heart just to tell those just to appreciate me and how they love me and everything like i'm just so grateful guys to have people in my life that I teach their kids, not only teaching their kids, but they love me so much. 
it is not easy to have that kind of a job here in Dubai. But when you have God in you guys, there is everything, guys. When you have God in you, God will always like, he will always do wonderful Six things. months, no job. And God just surprised me with this after fasting, guys. Like, come on! Who say God does not exist? Anybody that says that God does not exist, eh? That person is a liar from the pit of hell. Yes, guys. Anyway, so yeah, they, they gave me this. They gave me this like if you want to put on like you can put on like a traditional wear and then you put it on and then you take some pictures you know yeah anyway guys let us uh go to the next so this is the next so much i just say let me share this thing with you guys you know to motivate somebody it's not only about it's like not just about the gift but about how hard working we should be at our job site anywhere we find ourselves whatever thing that you find doing you make sure make sure guys that you do it well okay so i hope uh i hope i hope you've learned something in this video thank you so so much for clicking in and if it's your first time here please do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel don't forget to like share and subscribe don't forget to turn on the notification so anytime i upload a video you are going to be the first and not the last to see it i love you guys so much <laughs> Thank you guys so much for always being here for me and I love you guys so so much. Okay guys, bye. See you guys later.